Hello, hello there, Internet. I'm your everyday winner, and this is some more Pokemon Gold for you guys. So, I've done a lot of off screen training. I'll show you guys that right now. <clears throat> I went and faced almost every trainer I could in Kanto. Off screen, basically. My phone's vibrating, need to turn that off. Alright, so. Dragonair is level 44, didn't learn anything new. Swagtron's 51, Umbreon and Magnetron are both 44. And I caught a Houndor, and it's a Houndoom right now. I caught this at level 15. It's 32 right now because I went back to Mr. Pokemon, gave him my Gyarados scale, and I got the XP share. So he's level 32 right now. His name is Ignis, which means fire in Latin. I think it's pretty cool. I think I might do something like that for Dragonair and Umbreon too, but I just haven't got to it quite yet. <clears throat> he knows Faint Attack, Ember, Roar, and Bite. Not the greatest moveset, but hopefully he learns some good stuff in the future. So I want to show you guys this. This is the road to against Kanto, but this guy doesn't even think that I beat the Elite Four yet. So, screw you, buddy. I think I might have to go back and beat the Elite Four again off screen, but right now, what, I, what we're going to go do in this recording session is face all the gyms I can, because I've been to Cerulean, Vermilion, Lavender, Celadon, Saffron, and Fuchsia. Um, I can't get to um, these um, four cities over here, like Pallet Town, um, Pewter. I can't get to any of those because over here, um, the path from Cerulean City is blocked and the path down from Fushia City is blocked. So I can't do that right now, so I'm just going to have to wait, um, maybe go off screen beat the Elite Four again. I don't want to do that on screen. I want to uh, fight as many gyms as I can on screen right now. So we're going to go to Fushia, and uh, I believe that is the uh, Poison Gym. We're going to go face Koga. <clears throat> How are we looking right now? Alright, yeah, we're, we're all full health. I just wanted to double check and make sure. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure this is the poison gym. Aw, oh, this this fun stuff. With Janine, I'm pretty sure. Do we want to be leading out? Well, yeah, Dragonair can hold his own. He's 44 now. Same level as uh, Umbreon and Magnetron. Yeah, I know you're all fake. I just want to get some experience here. Oh, you think you're so funny? You fooled me. Haha. -ha. Up. Oh, there goes that audio again. The audio only messes up when I record. Or maybe I just don't listen to it when I'm doing off-screen stuff. Bulbasaur, level 30. <coughs> Some of the trainers had uh, 35 Pokemon, and I thought that was pretty impressive. But, of course, trainers in gym only have 30s. This is going to Oko you, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, wait. Come on, Bulbasaur. Sleep Powder. All right, I'm speeding up. Let's speed up here. We're speeding up. Come on. You can wake up. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, and then uh, Ignis always gains half the experience. He's pretty close to being um, up where the rest of the team is. Let's, since these are just, um, I assume the next one's going to be a Venusaur. I think Ignis can take him on. He's the same levels, level as them, and Ember is pretty weak. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry for that. Um, I have a bit of a sore throat today. But uh, as I was saying, he does have Ember. That's a bit of a weak move. But hopefully in the future, in his uh, future levels, oh, Poison Powder! He learns uh, Flamethrower or Fire Blast. I could teach him Fire Blast probably. Or um, some other better fire move. Something besides Ember, please. Because two hits to kill an Ivy, so that's kind of shitty. Oh, there we go. Yeah, you get, <laughs> and look, you get all the experience twice. Well, half the experience twice. You have Venusaur. Nope. Ignis, you could take on this Venusaur. I believe in you. You're awesome. You already doubled your levels anyways. So I think what the plan is, is that I'll face as many gyms as I can in this recording session, go off screen, beat the Elite Four again, hopefully that'll let me go over to um, Pallet Town and Pewter, I'll face all the trainers over there, level up some more, do another recording session where I face the gyms there, and then uh, I'll have enough badges to go off to Mount Silver, I'll do the, um, I might do the trainers on screen there, might, I'm not sure yet, and then uh, after that, I'm going to go off screen again, do a lot of training, and then uh, final episode will be facing red. So we're actually uh, pretty close. This is my, if I have this correct, this is my uh, third to last recording session. Because <clears throat> I, I, I like to do these and I like to record Pokemon Gold in bulk. I don't like to record one episode at a time like I do with my Minecraft videos. Because um, I feel as if I'll just run out of things to say in the Minecraft videos and that I'll just get, um, I don't know, too bored? Too quickly? Well, not bored isn't a good word. Let's go heal up Ignis. 
Um, I think that uh, making like um, session Minecraft videos are only good for adventure maps and stuff because I'll play those for a while straight. But I like to have just one objective for each episode for like the Minecraft experience and feed the beast and stuff like that. But this Pokemon Gold stuff, I intend to um, for you guys to watch it as a series as a whole, not um, episode by episode. Like, so when this is done, you could watch from episode 1 to whatever the last one is, 40-something, I think. The last one's probably going to be 40-something. And, um, it could just be, like, a straight shot, and there won't be that many pauses in between them. Just a few. Alright, yeah, Dragonair's still leading us off. <coughs> oh, you're, you're the real Janine? Are you? No, you're, you're just some... Picnicker Cindy, what do you got? Nido Queen. Not too bad. 36. Nice. I applaud you. Good job, Picnicker. You can actually beat the 35 level cap that seems to be on everything. And the audio's glitching out. To a KO. To a KO. To a KO. Yep, that's what I thought. Oh, that might hurt. Oh, not at all. Dragonair is just a beast. I, I'm loving. I'm starting to really love Dragonair. He's doing awesome. Gonna be a Dragonite in about 10 levels, and that's just gonna be even better. Oh my god. Dragonite is going to wreck people. Alright. Thought you were real funny there, huh, Picnicker? Whoa! You betcha, dude! I'm Janine! <coughs> Are you a guy? Uh. Gay! <laughs> Just figured I'd say that because, um, <coughs> what guy goes and dresses up as a girl? That's, um, well, actually, there's a lot of guys in the world that do that. And though they are called transvestites. And, um, yeah, it's, they're interesting people. I'm not gonna, like, say anything bad about transvestites because I accept all different kinds of people. Because I don't hate on certain people. People do what they want. Um,. If you want to be a transvestite, then be a transvestite. I don't care. Except I'm going to call this uh, little boy gay for dressing up like Janine. <laughs> Camper Barry. My disguise was right on. Dang. Wow. You seem so upset. I don't... I think... I think this one right down here is Janine. But I'll face one more first. Yeah, I know. I know you're not Janine. Foo -foo -foo -foo. Oh, you are Janine. Oh. <laughs> Wow, you're so, so funny, Master Trolley 2012! Who are you? Lass Alice wants to battle. Dat Lass. Send out Gloom. Alright, Gloom. Think you could take me on level 30? 14 levels lower? Like, these levels are so bad. They can give you at least, like, somewhat of a challenge. Or maybe I'm just completely overleveled, I don't know. Oh, that's right. Some Spore missed. You can't touch me. Speed up through this. Yeah, this is gonna be... That'll take too long anyways. You're done. You're done, Arbok. And another Gloom. At least Arbok's 34. I actually really like Arbok. And, um... <coughs> Arbok is kinda... It, Arbok is actually a really terrible Pokemon, but... The only reason why I like it is because... Arbok is the first Pokemon I've ever known. Cause when I was about 4 or 5 or so... I had a little, um, Arbok toy. Just a little, um, figurine. And I liked it a lot for some reason. I really liked that toy. And um, that's why I've always liked Arbok. Never had a problem with him. Wish he was a better Pokemon. I'll, I would use him, but he's he's not that great of Pokemon. Alright, Janine. I know you're Janine. No, you're not. Ah. Oh, okay. Yep, you can tell by the music. Oh, this is, this is great. I love this music. Janine looks somewhat badass, actually. Crobat. 36, not bad. Good job, Janine. Alright, let's see what, uh... See what, uh... Oh, damn! Dragon Breath destroyed your Crobat! Oh, jeez. Supersonic, really. Don't hit yourself, 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 don't hit yourself. Yeah, boy! Ah, love you, Dragonair. You're the best. You are the best. Alright, what do you got next? What else you got for me, Janine? Ooh, you have a team of five. Weezing. Um, I think I'll send out Swagtron. Just get through Weezing, cause Weezing is a physical wall, and I could just surf it and probably Oko it, cause Swagtron is extremely overleveled. 
51. You were amazing, Spike John.